Players presenting the Texas Instruments Innovation Challenge. So, here we are with the description of this project. This project is divided into three sub-modules. The first one is infrared proximity sensor mask. The second one is microcontroller board. And the third one is relay module, which is further connected to external machines like fan and light. First one being infrared proximity sensor mask. In this mask, we have used IR sensors to act as proximity sensors. Means if any surface approaches near IR pair, it will reflect the ample amount of light so as to send a high signal to the controller. The sensors are mounted on a mask and the mask is adjusted so as to cover the particular portion of the face. For example, if a sensor is kept in front of our lips and its distance is kept sufficient to reflect no light to the sensor and if we want to send some signal to the controller we have to move our lips little forward so that IR sensor senses a surface and sends a high signal to the controller 
Similarly, a set of signals can be generated by the sensor mask and can be sent to controller for further conditioning and processing. Second one is microcontroller board that is being used to process the output of the sensor mask which is in the form of binary values like 001 or 110. What controller does is decode these binary values to generate different signals to operate different machines. For example, if 100 is received as input to controller from sensor mask, first it will decode this binary value, then it will send the assigned signal for further processing to other module. And with this module, the LED array is attached to read the status of different appliances or to show some signals with the different color of LEDs. The third and the final sub-module of this project is relay switch, which is used to separate two electric circuits by means of a magnetic circuit, which means when a current flows through the coil of electromagnetic field is set up. The field attracts an iron armature whose other end pushes the contacts together completing the circuit and hence according to the signal received by the microcontroller it will switch on or off the particular relay and completes the circuit of particular appliance. This is the final module of this project in which we have compiled all the previously explained three sub modules. These are the three sensors and their outputs are connected to microcontroller pins as input. Hence, output of IR sensors acts as input to microcontroller. Now, these signals are decoded and sent to relay module. Hence, the output of microcontroller acts as input to relay some module. And according to signal received, particular relay switches on or off the particular device. For demonstrating, we have used two devices, fan and light. Green LED is used to set the initial conditions of the fan. And the red LED is used to set the initial conditions of the bulb. For setting the initial conditions of the appliances, we have provided the user the initial 10 seconds, 5 for each device. Now, as we get supply to microcontroller, green LED will glow for 5 seconds and if the user does not give any input to sensor mask in that time automatically controller will say that the device was initially off and in next 5 seconds the same applies for fan whose conditions are set by red LED and now I will give supply to the microcontroller board as we can see initially both the devices are off and hence the user will not give any input to sensor mask in initial 10 seconds means he will sit idle and the controller will automatically say that both the devices are off and no LED will glow and now if the user feels the need of switching on the fan he will use his facial gestures to switch it on by moving his lips little left and now if he feels the need of switching the fan off he will use the same facial gesture now for switching the light on he can move his lips little forward and then for switching it off he can use the same facial gesture and now the user will demonstrate the same experiment once again <laughs> 